Welcome to the Blind Guy Show Radio. Here's your host, Greg. Hello and welcome back. My name is Greg and I will be your host here on the Blind Guy Show. Today I would like to talk about my top five most annoying pet peeves as a blind person. All right, so my number one pet peeve as a blind person is when people come up to me and grab a hold of me. Now, this can happen anywhere. Uh, It mostly happens when I'm trying to use a restroom for the first time. People just come up to me and they either grab my arm, my shoulder, or I've even had people grab right a hold of my cane without telling me. And this is a no-no. You do not come up to a blind person and grab them. I mean, this is rude even if you're a sighted person. Nobody should just come up to you and grab you. And of course, there's many reasons why you just shouldn't grab a hold of a blind person. Number one, I could turn around and I could club you with my cane. (laughs) And the same thing could happen if you came up behind a sighted person and just grabbed a hold of them. They might turn around and clock you. Another reason why you shouldn't just grab a blind person is because, well, maybe I don't need your help. Maybe I'm perfectly capable of finding my way around. All right, so pet peeve as a blind person, number two. And that would have to be when people act as if I'm deaf and they scream at me. Come on, people. I can't see, but I'm not deaf. I don't know if you're confusing me with Helen Keller. Maybe you think that everybody that's blind has a hearing problem, too. I don't know. But don't yell at me. I can hear perfectly well. I can probably hear better than you can. (laughs) Pet peeve number three is when I'm talking to someone and they just walk away. Come on, people. I don't know if you're walking away. I can't tell. So I'm just going to continue to talk and talk and talk. And then I'm going to look like an idiot. And then I'm going to think that you're an idiot too. In fact, the next time you come up to talk to me, I just might walk away from you. My number four pet peeve as a blind person? When people talk to the person that I'm with and not me. Why would someone do this? I don't get it. If you're a waiter or waitress and you come up to the table and I'm talking with other people at the table... Why would you ask someone else with me what I want to order? And here's an example. My wife and I went to Tennessee a few months ago, and we went to some place called Parrot Mountain. So we went up to the ticket booth, and the woman behind the counter asked my wife, Is he blind? Why wouldn't you ask me? You know I'm blind, I'm wearing dark sunglasses, and I have my white cane. Obviously. So just talk to me. Come on. And number five, last but not least... This one might be the most annoying pet peeve that I have as a blind person. And that is when people move my stuff and don't tell me. As a blind person, everything has its own place. Everything has to be organized. And if you move something even six inches away, I have to search for it and I might not find it. And if I do find it, I might knock it over. If it's a glass or a bottle or something that's easily knocked over, I'm going to knock it over. If my shoes are somewhere on the floor, don't move them. I know where they are. I'm not going to trip over them. The same thing goes for headphones. I always use my headphones, so please don't move them. They're always in the same place. And the same thing with my iPhone. I always put my iPhone in the exact same places every time when I'm done using it. If you move that, I have no idea where it is. The only way I'll be able to find it is by doing the Hey Siri thing. So don't move my stuff, please. All right, guys. So let me know what your top five pet peeves as a blind person are. Or if you're sighted, you probably have some pet peeves too. Let me know what they are. Keep this conversation going down in the comments below. Thanks for watching. Thanks for tuning in to the Blind Guy Show Radio. If you haven't already, consider subscribing to the channel and turning on post notifications so you don't miss any more great content.